Feminism has been rampant for decades. During that time, huge strides have been made to empower women. Thanks to feminism, women have so many privileges and freedoms that they didn't have before. And yet, they're going through a slump in regards to happiness and overall satisfaction with their lives. Why are women less happy and satisfied? And what is it about them that makes men not want to marry them? One reason they are less happy is because of the dating market, which I referred to in our last part. If these women aren't dating, chances are they're also not getting married. On the other side of the coin, their friends who didn't consume all the propaganda so heavily did get married and they are having children. Many women who compare themselves with their friends, and they do, realize that they aren't making strides in that direction or are anywhere near their perfect day. So that makes them unhappy. According to the Institute for Family Studies, women are happier and more satisfied if they are married than not, and happier married with no kids versus kids by a metric of twice as much. Another thing they are upset about is the myth of the wage gap. Even though it is against the law to pay women less for exactly the same skill, effort, and responsibility. By complaining that they aren't paid the same implies that they either aren't working as hard, as many hours, or as well as men are. Also consider debt. With women being predominantly the ones going to college, and more and more of them unable to find a job right out of university for their major, imagine that, how can they expect to pay off their dozens of to thousands of dollars of debt by asking, do you want your drink venti? What a lot of women are doing, unfortunately, are they're making money by showing their bodies online. They are realizing that they can make a lot more money doing that than actually doing good, honest work. Until they get older and realize that they aren't as attractive as the younger and better looking women who are showing up later. So add to all of that, combined with what we're going to talk about next week, and it's no wonder women are unhappier. Great job, feminism. You did it.